Hey guys in this video we are going to be checking out the best garden lopper, through extensive research and testing we've put together a list of options that'll meet the needs of different types of buyers we have included options for every type of user so whether you are looking for a best budget, like the video comment and don't forget to subscribe now let's get started with the video, number 1, Fiskars 39146110003 Bypass Lopper, 28 inch, for reasonably priced cutters that don't sacrifice. Performance, these Fiskars bypass loppers are a solid choice, the rust-resistant stainless steel blades are hardened in precision ground, meaning they'll retain their edge over an extended period, the low friction coating allows the blades to cut through wood easily and results in less sap residue, I found these Fisker loppers easy to use on green branches and the cutting action to be super smooth, I didn't spot any tearing of the limbs or ragged cuts, which tend to make a tree more. Susceptible to disease, these 28-inch cutters are suitable for living, green growth with a cutting capacity of branches up to 1-5 inches thick, shock-absorbing bumpers make the tool easier to use, and padded grips offer additional comfort, while these loppers aren't the lightest on the list, they still weigh a modest 2-9 pounds, so they're not difficult to use when cutting overhead, all loppers used to cut green wood will get slightly wet and may become covered in sticky sap, so being able to Wipe the blade clean is a big plus, those looking for a quality cutting tool at a reasonable price won't be disappointed with these Fisker loppers, pros, sharp cuts. Wipe clean blade. Padded, non-slip grips. Budget friendly. Cons, no safety lock. Number 2, Spear and Amp, Jackson Ratcheting Anvil Lopper. When you need something more substantial for cutting extra tough branches and growth and a basic anvil lopper won't do, then the extra power from a ratcheting mechanism may be what's called for. This ratcheting anvil lopper from Spear and Amp, Jackson has a whole host of features that makes light work of cutting back even dead, woody branches in high up or hard to reach places, as with the Tabor anvil above. They are made from lightweight aluminum and weigh just a little heavier at 1.5 kg, they do. Offer telescopic handles that extend from 18 inches up to 28 inches and can be adjusted with a simple twist and lock action mid-cut. I've found this to be a really useful feature when cutting back the various different areas of my yard from trees to shrubs to bushes. It's all possible given the varying lengths available with this lopper, okay? So you're not going to be able to cut branches with any greater diameter than 1-5 inches, but they are great when faced with dead, woody branches in high. Up or hard to reach places thanks both to the ratcheting housing that combines additional leverage with more force, I also find that overall, the ratchet style lopper decreases the risk of tatty looking cuts and is certainly more precise, oh, and they have easy grip handles to make for a more comfortable hold, number 3, Tabor Tools GG12A Anvil Lopper, at first, I wondered if the Tabor Tool Anvil Loppers would cut through stiff dead branches since they don't come with ratcheting action, I need. Not of worried, the loppers instead feature compound cutting action via a short pivoting arm located at the fulcrum of the blades that increases cutting power, the manufacturer advertises the loppers as being able to cut through dry branches up to 2 inches thick, I didn't quite pull that off, but I was able to cut through a dead branch on an elm tree that was 1-5 inches thick, someone with a bit more arm strength than me could likely cut through a 2 inch branch, I was super impressed with the grips on this set of loppers, they're soft and slightly padded, and I could exert pressure without my hands slipping, at 30 inches long, the sizable arms allowed me to increase my leverage on the branches, a shock absorbing bumper would have been a nice addition, but this is a decent set of loppers for cutting dry wood, at 3-5 pounds, the Tabor loppers are well suited for use overhead without too much wrist and arm fatigue for an average user. Pros, comfortable non-slip grips. Long arms for reaching high branches. Compound cutting action. 3 5 pounds, Tabor loppers. Cons, no ratcheting action. Number 4, Spear and Amp, Jackson 8290RS Heavy Duty Telescopic Loppers. I trimmed away several dead willow branches that were damaged in an ice storm earlier this year with the Spear and Amp, Jackson loppers. Willow is hard when dry, but the ratcheting action of these loppers increased the cutting force, and with just a slight pumping action, I was able to cut through dead branches as large as 1 5 inches. These loppers can take a little getting used to when I first spread the handles, the blades didn't open until the handles reached their maximum spread and then the blade head snapped open, it took 4 pumps of the blade handle to cut completely through a branch from that point, with each pump, the ratchet action increased the cutting force on the branch until it cut through, I was able to twist the bottom of the handle and then pull to lengthen it, this is an excellent feature for those who start a cut and decide they need more leverage from longer handles, at 4, 2 pounds, these. Loppers are on the heavy side, so I had to take a few breaks, but they offer a whole lot of cutting power, pros, ratcheting action for powerful cutting, easy handle twist adjusting, safety lock, carbon steel blade, 
Cons, slightly heavy for overhead use. Number 5, Fiskars 32 inch Power Gear Bypass Lopper. Fiskars Power Gear 32 inch Bypass Loppers top my best loppers list. It's a popular choice not only for its cutting power but also for its lifetime warranty and outstanding build quality, making it my best bypass loppers choice. When I pulled these off the mounting card they are supplied with and opened the handles to check the range of movement and feel I was blown away. The two pin pivot power gear mechanism generates up to three times the cutting power and splays the blades open for a two. Cutting gate, the lightweight aluminum handles make these an ideal product for anyone concerned about weight, okay, they are not the lightest but have a great weight to power ratio, back this up with super comfortable grips and I was really happy with what this tool had to offer, I took to the testing center, my backyard, and began cutting through a variety of branches and limbs with ease and pleasure, thick bamboo, birch, and oak were no problem and I experience a clean cut with no problems. With the blade sticking on any limbs, these are the perfect loppers for pruning live wood, I highly recommend these as my best loppers, on a very good shortlist. Alright guys that's all for now. Please leave a like on the video, if you are new here hit that subscribe button and enable your notification bell icon to get the latest videos of our channel. Be sure to check out the description for links to find the most updated pricing on all the products mentioned in this video.